how is it going everybody mr android here welcome back to a brand new video on this channel today i'll be showing you some of the best apps that will take your android customization to the next level so if you love customizing your smartphone then stay tuned and watch this video till the very end also let's aim for at least 1000 likes on this one with that said drop a like leave a comment and let's get started well if you want to add some more functionality to your always on display then there is an app called AOD plus which lets you view and interact with notifications directly from your always on screen all you have to do is simply install the app from the play store and allow the permissions that are required once done it will let you see any incoming notification in detail and i can also swipe left or right to navigate between multiple notifications the best part is that I can respond to WhatsApp messages, mark emails as read and do lot more without unlocking my phone. You can even customize the notification style to your preference and in case if you want to save some battery then there is an option to set the app to work only while your device is charging. So if you are tired of missing important notifications when your phone is locked then it's a perfect app for you. Now the only drawback is that the app is not free but trust me it's totally worth your money. Next up we have the wallpaper app that has recently launched on the play store and it's called Lumina Walls. It is made by Sam Backman, a fellow YouTube creator and this is your one stop shop for finding some amazing wallpapers for your home screen. As you can see there is a huge library of many beautiful wallpapers and every time you open this app you will be tempted to change your phone's wallpaper. Other than the wallpaper collection, I also like the UI of this app. It looks modern and clean with some nice animations and the best part is that you get more than 300 free AI wallpapers that are absolutely stunning to look at. If you want to unlock all the other wallpapers, then you need to pay for the pro version. But honestly, I think the free version is more than enough to satisfy your wallpapers need. Be sure to check this one out. You will find all the links in the description below. At number 3 we have this really cool application which goes by the name called Notification Quick Tool Access. This app lets you easily handle all the tools you use on a regular basis through notifications. Now what it basically does is, it allows you to add some useful widgets on your notification panel for easier access. You just need to install the app from the play store and allow all the required permissions. Once that is done, now you can select the widgets that you would like to add to your notification panel. You can add widgets to access the calculator, calendar, equalizer and there is a widget to quickly take down all your notes. Overall I think it's a pretty useful application that will help you make better use of your phone's notification panel. Definitely give this app a try, it is totally free on the play store. The next app on today's list is called iPro and it essentially functions as an advanced version of a blue light filter specifically designed for smartphones. Guys this app has so many options like you can decide which color you want as an overlay on your screen, you can increase the intensity, brightness, add some relaxing sounds in the background, you can adjust the color temperature, you can also choose the time in which you want the night mode to get activated and there are many useful settings that will help you reduce eye strain when using smartphone. Overall I think it's a feature packed blue light filter that has a lot more functions to offer when compared to the basic filter which is built into most android devices. The next app on today's list is actually an offline music player that I recently found out and it's called Music Sign Pro. This app has a lot of unique and cool features that can surely make your music listening experience a lot more fun. Not only it has this beautiful looking UI where you can listen to your favorite songs but it also has theme support which means you can customize and change the entire theme depending on your mood. Apart from this it also has features like lyric support. You can adjust the playback speed and there is this cool feature that allows you to change the track by simply shaking your phone. Overall I think it's a really unique music player that you can find on the play store for completely free. I will highly suggest you to give this app a try. Next up we have an app called Smart Dock. This application activates a really useful dock right at the bottom of your screen so you can easily access all of your most used applications from anywhere on your smartphone. This dock constantly changes the app list based on what apps you are frequently using and you can quickly switch between them one after the other which definitely makes your multitasking experience a lot better. Other than this, it also has a lot of customizations like you can change the dock color, you can apply different icon packs, you can customize the app opening animation, you can add more applications in your dock and there is an option to add some quick toggles as well. I think it's a really useful app that can save a lot of your time and improve the multitasking experience on your smartphone. If you're looking for a way to save some battery while still enjoying your favorite music or podcast in the background, then this is a must-have app for you. It allows you to play videos from YouTube or any other platform while keeping the screen off and saving some battery. 
This can be super helpful when you're listening to your favorite podcast or music videos on YouTube. All you have to do is simply allow the required permissions and now when you're watching a video on your phone, you just need to open the quick settings panel and tap on this icon. If you want to go back to normal mode, simply tap anywhere on your screen. Additionally, you can set a time limit for a video and the app will stop the playback and close itself automatically. Overall, I think it's a really useful app that can save some battery and prevent burn-in issues by keeping the pixels off. Definitely give this app a try. So that's pretty much it for this video. These are some amazing apps that will take your customization to the next level. If you guys like this video, then be sure to hit that like button. Subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. I am Mr. Android and I'll see you guys in the next one.